price page and this oh, this no, one she, here. She's done the way that I've just mm. kept their records, which mm. is lovely, actually records a little bit of the history of the Southampton Church starting 1878. Can I get a picture? Can I get a picture? Of course you can. That's great. <laughs> The other sign says boom. Because we often get people searching through. <laughs> <laughs> and then we hear them giggle. Wow. Is there anything else? <laughs> no, 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 no. Because that's, that's also got a date on it. Oh, yeah, that's, so, that's the good shot there. Got the date on it as well. It shows that the Adventists were right then and there taking care to keep records. Yeah. Okay, but you can see the date when it ends. Oh, your shadow, Adam. Can you say the gym? <laughs> I don't want to show you up. The commission is to go into all the world, no matter how easy or hard the work may be. If you are living and working for Christ today in an area and you're not getting the success that you hoped or dreamed of, then I want to encourage you to stay faithful at your duty. For God rewards us not according to our seeming success. three missions and two conferences, a newly formed college and a health food factory. Turn your body towards the sun. That way. Uh, take another giant step forward. In 1907, the two institutions, along with the British Union headquarters of the British Union to this day, British Union to this day. Even though church membership increased by 20% through the war, World War I would prove a huge test. This memorial stands here as a testament to their faith under fire. Faith under fire. You've got a screwdriver. <laughs> my, my middle name on it. My dad gave it to me. <laughs> You'll remember that. <laughs>